Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlett Tanager, and I'm here with some Talos Principal. We last left off, I was talking with a bunch of friends. Because that's what I do. Can I get in here? Yes, I can! Let's do ourselves a puzzle. Um... Wait, this is a hard one. Bum, bum... Let's see here. Let's rotate. No. How do I... There we go, that's how I rotate it. Um, let's put that one there. There, that one there, and there we go! Um, not as difficult as I thought it was. Okay, what does this give me? I have unlocked the cube! Is it a companion cube? I'm gonna go with it's a companion cube. Okay. Let's find a world we haven't been to yet. Been there. Been there. Been to there. Been to four. Let's go to five. Yes. Not been to five just yet. I also haven't been looking at computers like I should have. So let's look at computers more. Wait, what? Did I stay there for too long? Go in the thing. There we go. Oh. Oh dear. Computer! You is the computer. And certification programs now been generated. Um, begin. Uh, oh, I can click on this. Since only animals can be persons, a machine can never be a person. Broadly disagree. A person is under no authority other than that to which they consent. Ooh, that's a hard one. A person has no authority on other than that to which they consent. Yes and no! But it only gives me a yes or no answer. Uh, Quality of life of persons ought to be maximized. Yes. Value is discovered. Not necessarily. Wait, what? Even I'm not sure, but that's not what I clicked. Um, persons deserve the talent. Deserve the talent they are born into. Um, no. Liberty of persons ought to be maximized. Yes. Value is created. Yes. Kind of! A notification when user profile has been generated. Okay. Terminating support session. Something that we're active session list. What? EL. HTML. EL, short for Extended Lifespan, is a groundbreaking initiative by seven leading universities to create the world's most stable and most durable supercomputer. With its custom hardware, bomb proof casing, and near inexhaustible hydroelectric power supply, E.L. Elohim represents the unique step forward in the evolution of the child of the Nobel, of Nobel Prize nominee Dr. Arkady Chernoskivsky. Cherno uh, okay. AI citizenship? Once a true artificial intelligence has been created, the issue of citizenship is going to come up. If we acknowledge that the AI has all the abilities of a human brain, should it not be considered a citizen? If not, in the legal sense of the word, a person, thus a potential citizen. But where do you draw the line? Some people will object. Will the great apes become citizens? Elephants, whales, more intelligent parrot species? It's crazy, they will say. I will remind people that we live in a society in which a corporation, an abstract entity as one could imagine, is considered a person. So it's not like there is no precedent for a non-human being a person. At least an artificial intelligence is actually thinking we, not a business arrangement. <laughs> Perhaps we do need to question the definition of personhood. Increasing amounts of evidence regarding the intelligence of elephants or the existence of a culture among whales, for example, can be a sign that we need to answer some difficult questions. Who better to debate these questions with than the young genius who revolutionized the <laughs> Okay, I've got something to say about that. I believe that once we reach the singularity, once we have a truly conscious AI, that's a person. That is an E. And should be treated as such. Athena, you must consider these riddles, the Sphinx said, and tell me the riddle that I did not reveal. The Sphinx smiled, the gears in her jaw creaking, her teeth a nightmare of rust. Her left eye flickered, but none of its terror was diminished. The runes were silent in the error. 
I think she finally said that the riddle you did not reveal is this. Why do these riddles exist in the first place? Why do these curious automatons, these mute children of Hephaestus, believe as they do, forcing me to devise these intricate solutions? Each is a p riddle, but the greater riddle is their purpose. The Sphinx did not answer her. I was lifeless. Athena removed it from its socket, knowing that its power would aid her, yet feeling also a deep sorrow at the passing of this fearful creature. That's... Okay. <laughs> I understood. Maybe half of that. Press tab to access. Oh, cool. You can read them again. So let's go through... Where does this take me? What's that? I want it. What is it? I was in school when I first read about the Talos Principle. Okay. I think it disturbed me at the time. Made me hyper aware of my body as a physical object. The material reality of the brain. Ideas that made me uncomfortable at first. But I think in the long run, it helped me understand how frail human beings are. And how precious. It's not a comforting way of thinking about the world, but... I'd rather face the truth than lie to myself. Oh, the bomb keeps getting in the way. Damn it, bomb. Yeah. So that was interesting. Wait, what? Hey, oh, that's cool. going to come bomb me. Aha! Success. I love how I don't trigger the thing. But whatever. Not a cube. It is a cube. Oh, where am I going? This way. Whee! Bonk. We got this puzzle over here. Going over the fence to get a Tetris bomb. See what materials I've got. Can't go that way. We need something blue. Aha! Is there anywhere I can put this? Apparently, I'm not allowed to go up there. Um... Can I jump up here? Oh, wait! Wait, 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 wait. Bonk, bonk, bonk! Woo! Uh, now I think I'm stuck. Oh. Never mind. Can I go? They would make it tall enough for it to stretch both ways. Can I see it from here? Maybe from the other side, perhaps? Aha! Success. Come here, Mr. Thing. Yike! That and connect it to there and put it there. Yeah! I'm good at puzzles. I'm the puzzle master. Okay, we've got this one. It means we need two more before we can open B. Whoops. Is that a red one? Have I gotten red ones before? Friendly crossfire! I don't think there's anything friendly about this, honey. Am I too far? Am I too far? Good. Uh, oh boy. What the? Huh? Here, those who are worthy may seek the counsel of my blessed messengers. But their wisdom shall not be given easily, for your accomplishments must be your own. Thanks, God! The 
council of my so blessed messengers really must be heard. <laughs> no messenger will aid you until you've discovered their resting place. Return here, then to seek their council. Okay. Let's see. Can't get very far doing that. I... Nope, that's not going to help. Maybe if I'm just really quick about it? Didn't do it! Another one that I can use somewhere? Anywhere? Anywhere at all? No balls. Got an idea. If I go over here and I jam that one, then I can get across. Yep. Okay, I'm across. Can I disarm it? Nope! Apparently not! Good to know! Do not try and disarm it. That will lead to bad. Okay, okay, okay. So we've only got one jammer. <laughs> Has anyone solved this one? Ah, fine. That one? No, that's not gonna help me, is it? I need to get that box out of the way. Wait a minute, what happens if I just open this? Is there something back there? I thought I saw something move. Aha! An explosion? Yes! And now maybe I can get this one. Wait for it to go. go. In. Grab that back out. Take that. And watch the fireworks happen. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Thingy. Hello there. Hello there. Boom. And four, let's do a jam on that. Closer. Nope. Science doesn't work like that, sadly. I guess we're going to have to do things the hard way. Ah, I did it before! Damn it. I can do it all over again. First off. Oh wait! I can just go this way. Go the other direction. Duh. Okay, let's jam that. Explodes. Take this. And... Then that. And then explosions happen. Jam that. Run across here. Nope, you see nothing! Unless, could there be something over here that would be useful to me? 
Might as well go see. I see Bob Kiss so far. Odd Star! I don't know what these are used for, but Odd Star! Run! Wait a minute, is that a pressure plate? Oops, wrong button. Um, jam that. I swear I saw a pressure plate there. Ha ha! It was not as complicated as I was making it out to be. We've got a red one. And I don't have access to red ones just yet, which is somewhat disconcerting. Let's go here and get a line block. A line blockiness. Okay, so we've got two boxes in here. Can I put them on top of each other? That one obviously needs to be there, so let's go bring the other one with us just in case. Oh, or I can hit a wall, that too. Whee! Thunk. In here? Nope! Oh! Oh dear! <gasps> you didn't see anything. Uh, I don't know what that's gonna do, but... Maybe it'll make it so... If I'm careful... I can get past? I just panicked. Okay. Phone, knock it off. Let's try it again. At least I kinda think I know what I'm doing, I think. Maybe, maybe I know what I'm doing. This way. This way. Hi guys. Nobody's here! Nobody's here! Okay, I gotta be careful with this, and he's gone away, and I am through! Woohoo! Wait, what? Shit! just keeps getting dangerous, doesn't it? And now we need me to get back through. I'm going to wait for him to start going back down, and that'll be my chance to grab the box and leg it. I got too close to one! Okay. This is gonna be really, really finicky for me to get this damn box through, isn't it? Things to do with two boxes. What happens if I pick it up again? Yep, we need that down there. That one cannot move. There doesn't seem to be a pressure plate on the other side for it, so we've got to get. Oh dear! Gone. I'm through! Yes! Okay. Put that down there. Jump. Jump. And line block! Woo! What's this? If the designer is perfect, he's defined me for a purpose. I must fit for that purpose. Follows that my purpose must not be to seek and hoard every sigil in this land, for so many are beyond the faculties that granted me. Okay. I don't understand why the designer chose to put such flaws into the world as it appears almost as if it were damaged, but I must believe that there's a purpose here I cannot see. There probably is, Mr. Man. There probably is. Or not, and they're just being jerks. Wait, 
what? There's another L block? Oh, hey! I almost missed this one. You know you mustn't cross the streams. Okay. Wait a minute. I got an idea, I got an idea, I got an idea. I think I've already got this one. Do that. Grab the box. Put the box about here. Pick it up. Cookity clack. Clickety clack. Spoom. Now I should be able to take this one and get it without crossing the street. Button. That was easy. And it's ooh, we finished one. And it's also the last one for this episode. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Palos Principle. I'll see you all in the next episode.